Welcome back guys, CryptoFly channel. Today we'd like to talk about how we can work with Peach Fan in Fibonacci category two on TradingView. Let's dive in. Like I explained to you before, all of that tools, a million traders will use in totally different ways because uh, we got a totally different time frames, totally different vision of the market, different vision of the K levels. That's why, guys, uh, you have to adjust it, all of that tools to your vision, to your strategy, to your analysis. And of course, someone can use the candles, someone can use the Heiken Ashi candles and levels will be totally different. Someone can trade by line chart, for example. All of that traders will be correct and only the time will show you which one level are uh, legit or not and uh, you can open your trades depends on your risk management you know of course how to work with that tool first of all we need to find the three k points swings one two three for example let's use it let's use the magnet here is a first starter point first then low this one and the third top here this is it. And by that default settings, when we use the three points, you can find out how the price respect the levels. So here is a touch of equilibrium. So this is the equilibrium. This is a touch like support of that level. This is a touch like support of that level. And here's a like resistance. Also, you can adjust all of that levels up to you by colors or by levels. You can turn on or turn off any of that levels like you can see here so you turn on 38 level by feet so it's a classic one so you can find out the reaction so in this case it looks like we fly in the air right but here's a support and here's a also support got it here's a 0 0.61 level by feet we also got a one two three four a touch like re, uh, like support here was also the support got it here's a 75 level by feet here's a pure uh, rejection Retest, retest and rejection. Turn on and turn off 75 low by FIB. Looks like it's random, but basically no, it's not. To know the next step, you need to adjust your uh, FIB to the next level, like 1.61 and 8, this one. Got it. And we can trade in that fan. The next step is going to be the top of that high. It means if we're breaking out that high, it will be the new all-time high and we need to redraw basically that fan. But while that chart going on the right side all the time, we can trade long time period in that range. So it can be like that move or it can be that drop to that level. So basically this is a way how you can use that tool on totally different time frames. I recommend you to use it's like a, just a helpful instrument uh, for analysis not like a one main tool to open trades i hope you like this video subscribe channel hit the like button hit the notification button don't forget to join my telegram channel see you next time guys